back at the lake. We're gonna go and look for some more walleyes again. Uh, it's a beautiful day. Started out pretty cool this morning, but uh, probably about 10:30, 11 o'clock now. But it was down in the 50s this morning, and then uh, it's gradually gotten nicer and nicer. It's probably about 64 now. So we're gonna have a nice warm day today and we're just gonna get out and get my shoes in here I'm gonna get out and uh, just see what's biting got quite a few boats well some of them have cleared out now but we did have quite a few boats on the dam I assume they're looking for white bass and wipers but I think today we're going to go a little bit different route. We're still going to troll around and try to find them with flicker shads and stuff, but I think we're going to work this whole side of the lake. Just take off today and just head, head due, uh, due west and just, just troll through there and see if we can't pick something up. There's a couple bluffs down here, points that I want to try to hit. It looks like there's some boats down there. So that could be a good sign. Uh, it's pretty calm. There's no wind, which is good for a kayak, but uh, not the greatest for walleye fishing. But hopefully we can find something in here and and uh, bring, you some, bring you some more catches for the day. Stay tuned. Try a little different angle on the camera today. We may even move it up towards the front, but we'll see what happens. So I got the buoys out for no wake zone. I think we're gonna just go ahead and throw out here. Two different flicker shads here. <coughs> First one we got on is a uh, this is kind of a deeper diver with this split body. So we're going to try that first. See how that works for that one. And then we've got another deep diver, but this is a solid body, and this is a flicker minnow. bit shallower so we'll run that on the inside. Yeah, kick these out. Nice to have both my pole holders. I finally found the, the bottoms to them. The bottom to this one is in my tackle box. There's a lot of marks here. 14 and 16 foot. I don't know what they are, but I suppose we'll find out here, maybe. 10 foot. This one on the left is uh, about a seven to eight foot dive. Oh, there's a hit right there. We got one right off the bat. Oh, I don't know what. Feels good, but I don't know what we got. Got some weight to it, I think. Staying low, whatever it is. Kind of weird. Oof. We didn't even get off the shore hardly, and we got a fish. Maybe we're going to be lucky and find a walleye on the end of this. It's big, whatever it is. It's not small. Either that or I foul hooked a, a white bass. 
trying to dig, I think it's a walleye. It is. It's a nice walleye. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh he barely got it though. Let's see if we can boat flip him in here. Oh, there he is. Check that out. Check that out. Oh. We come out here the first minute and just crush a nice walleye. Oh, calm down, buddy. Don't get me with those hooks. That would be a bad start to the day. That would be a bad start to our day. Not your day, but my day, for sure. Oh my goodness, can you believe this? Get that out of your deal plate. Gosh dang it, dude. You had to go thrashing around and you got that all up in your shit. Open your mouth. He's not opening his mouth. Boy, he annihilated that thing. Dude, what did you do to yourself here? There we go. We got that one out. Look at this fish. He's a chunk. I'm trying not to tear you up, but man, you, you did a number on that thing me here you got one in the bottom mouth you got one in the top we almost got it we almost got it but these hooks are so sharp oh there we go look at that look at that that's a good eating size right there oh about the same size as the one we caught last week but he's a little bit heavier he's a chunk he's a little chunk <laughs> nice we'll let you go bud there he goes that's a good sign I like that I like that Wow first fish and I mean he was dogging on that thing he wanted it bad all right, let's get back out there and see if we can't find something. I wish I knew about how deep he was at. We had a lot of marks right there, though. That was good. All right, let's get these going again. Man, I got all kinds of crap in my glasses. going about two, two point two miles an hour. I'm telling you, they're in this uh, this mud, this sandbar. We're gonna run out here a little bit deeper. We're at twelve foot right now. If I remember right, I think we were around six, fourteen or sixteen right there when he hit. Well, as I figured, we we started really uh, peeling the last week or so. We got terrible sunburn that last time out. Hopefully we can get in our tan today. I put sunscreen on today, though. I put big uh, clip swivels on this time. And they're a little big for these. They might be a little bit big, but that one... He, he hit it, so I know that they'll hit it, even with those big swivels on the front. Oh, there's one right there. Oh, that's a good fish, too. Holy cow. That's a, it feels like a good fish now. I don't know. Yeah, he's coming in pretty easy now, unless he's coming in. Oh, there we got a little tug. There we got a little bit of a tug. That's a white bass, I think. He's coming up pretty quick. Oh no, it's a walleye. It's another walleye. Another walleye. That was a quick release. Oh my gosh, that's two 
keepers in a row. He's got to be nine. He's almost 18. Look at that, another one. Another nice one. Boy, we may have to start keeping these if we keep on them. I've got a cooler, but I don't have any ice in it right now. And I really want to, I really don't like to drag them around all day. Uh, yeah, and we're just having a good time. <laughs> That's two. I was just sitting there talking and just watching that pole a little bit. And Boy, it just kind of pink and boom, just, just kind of took off. Boy, we might we might hook up into a big one. We might get ourselves a nice one today. The way they're going, we're going about two two point two still. We're going to keep it right at that and stay in that. Oh, there's one right there. Oh my gosh, that's a pig. That's a pig. That's a pig, I think. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, it's coming to me. Boy, when it first bent over, man, I mean, it was down. It was down. Oh. No, that's a little white bass. Okay. Got all excited there for a second. We haven't really even got to our good spot yet. I mean, where we were catching them last week was over. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That's a freaking pig. That is a pig. Oh my gosh. I, got, I don't want to get wrapped up in that other line. That is a monster, whatever it is. That is a monster, whatever it is. Line, uh, that thing almost took my pole in. Ho, 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 ho. My drag's good. Yep. I don't know what it is, but it's a pig, whatever it is. It's a white bass. It's a big white bass or a wiper. Oh, I think I foul hooked him. That's why. Boy, I'll tell you what. That felt like a giant, whatever. When I first hooked into him, he felt a huge. I got him in the top of the head and the side plate. Man, I'll tell you what, he was rocking and rolling with that hook in him. Look at that. Right in the side of him. I mean, he hit that so fast, he stuck that hook right into his side. Ouch, I just stabbed that other hook in my finger. <laughs> Oh, we're having a ball today already. I can't believe it. It's already been worth it. And I got to watch these poles. If a guy, if I get it, if I get into a big one, he's going to take that pole and just run. A helicopter was out here yet last week, too. He must be giving rides or something. I don't know. I've never seen a helicopter come around this lake like that. coming right over us. Pretty crazy, huh? Getting some chop now, a little bit of chop on the water. Wind's picking up, breeze is picking up. That might be a good thing. Not that we haven't had any luck already. I turned this camera on like right when we got out here and I haven't shut it off yet. That's how good it's been so far. Yeah, the lake that I'm on here is uh, Harlan. And I know you've heard me talk about this lake when I was hunting, when I've been hunting and stuff. I like to hunt around here too. But uh, this lake is Runs east and west. Not sure how many square acres. It's a pretty, pretty nice lake. It's a pretty good sized lake. 
I'm sure the uh, the wipers are getting ready to move into the dam. Might be why there was a lot of guys there to begin with. Catching wipers on this lake is a blast. They are so aggressive. Ooh, we got a lot of marks in here. Those all can't be, they can't all be carp. I'm expecting something to happen here. Seems to be that magic number off these beaches is about 11 to 14 normally, but we're at 14 and a half. There's a hit. Oh, that's a good fish right there. Ooh. That's a tank. That's a tank, whatever it is. I'll hook the carp or something, I don't know, but it's big, whatever it is. Get this other one in so I don't get it wrapped up in it. There we go. It's not giving me anything right now. Oh, he got me hooked up. He hooked me around something. He's got me wrapped around something. Dang it, man. That was a pig. He went right into the crap. I think we got him loose. Oh, we broke whatever he was wrapped in. Oh, it's just a damn, it's a damn white bass with a big ass limb attached to him. You joker. You joker. Come here. Look at this crap. Look at this dog crap. Oh. I thought I, had, I thought I had something big on there. He was foul hooked for one and then he got wrapped up in that tree and I don't know if he was coming with me for a little bit or what the deal was, but it felt huge at first. Oh, there's one. This is just a white bass, I can tell by the way he hit. Got this thing all twisted in your jaw. There you go. There you go, buddy. Well, I'm not gonna have to do much editing on this video. Everything's been right after one, right after the other. Let's see what's on this other side. I know there's a there's a big cove back in there where we hunt off of. There's a big one. Oh, that's a good sized fish right there. Another pig. Oh. Oh. This one's a pig, unless he's got me wrapped up too.
Well, maybe not. I don't know. It's hard to tell when they're that far back. Once they get closer, kind of feel them a little better. Get the walleye though. Yep, another walleye. Oh, that's a nice one too. We have got our limits, folks. We have actually got our big limit. That's a nice walleye. <laughs> That's my biggest walleye today. There he is. That's a nice walleye. Let's see what he weighs. See if I can get my scale out of here. Look at that. Two and a half pounds. So he's probably eight or nine. He's over 18 inches, so all right, let's let him go. Woo! Good release. Good and healthy. Ah, I got a walleye in here too. That's two. I had a double. I didn't know it. Are you kidding me right now? I had a double and didn't even know it. This has been the greatest day of walleye fishing I've ever had. It's insane. Freaking double. That little guy, he's too small, but we've limited it out. I mean, if we were keeping him, we'd have our limit. We would have our limit today. Uh, oh, there's a hit. You got one. Oh, that's a good pull, too. I'm sitting here messing around with my... Messing around with my chew and my... Jet finder, little white bass. Man, all these guys are, oh, there's another one. All these guys are running all these specialty spots. And they're just passing up walleyes like crazy. I'm not saying that, uh, I'm not saying that this is where you find the big ones by any means, but if you want to limit out, you can limit out over here. Or just enjoy the day like I'm doing. Just enjoy the day. I'm getting in some new territory, which is always exciting. You can get into new spots, places you've never been, see what's there. That might be that special day, and I'm telling you what, today's turning out to be a pretty special day so far. Big. That's a good fish. That was on the split body. Oh. Let's see what we got here. I'm trying not to rock that camera too much for you guys, but. Oh, I got another one. I got a double. Either that or he's in my other line. I don't think he is, though, because that one's clear off this side. Get this one taken care of here first. Uh, got a double. Oh, he's pulling drag. He's pulling drag. Oh, white bass. Oh, God. That's got to be a white bass on this other one, too. Got a double. We must have went right through that group of white bass. This one feels bigger though. This one does feel bigger. Unless I foul hooked him again.
It's a white bass for sure, because it's, yeah, I foul hooked him. Boy, these guys just swipe so hard at it, and they miss, and they just get smoked with those hooks. Look at that. He's just got him all over his body. He's just all kinds of wrecked up. Oh, that's a good size, whatever it is. I think. Yeah, a bigger white bass or wiper. Better size. Good size. And so crazy, I can't even get a drink in. Should have brought some water. There's another hit. There's another one. Boy, these white bass are wipers or whatever. Dumping these chat. Look at Shad. There's another one. I've got a double. We got a double. We've got a double. Yeah, I got two things going. Did he get off? Yeah, he may got off. That's all right. It's probably going like later. White bass are. Oh, there's one. My gosh, I can't keep these white bass off of here. Oh, cannot keep them off. Oh, that's a puller, man. He's a puller, whatever it is. Uh, I was going to say, that's the nice thing about a kayak. Is you don't really have the problems with the motors and you can kind of go wherever you want to shallow or deep oh it's a wally oh he just got off i saw him though ah, had a nice little walleye on there again he's about a 12 12 inch probably oh there's one like an okay fish. Not the same as all the rest of them. Not bad. I don't think it's a walleye though, but seems like every time I try to guess I'm, I'm wrong. So hey. I'm pretty sure this is a white bass the way it's moving around. It's kind of spread. Oh no, it's a walleye. It's another walleye. Five or six, I think it's six. I think this one's six. Look at that little guy. Nine. Yeah, he's about twelve. A little small. catching fish. So this is a white bass or a drum. No, it's a walleye. It's another walleye. Yeah, he's only about 12 or so. There's another one. Shoreline, you're you're only at 10, 12 feet here, and it's gradually that one, right there, gradually getting deeper, but not real fast. Feels so different.
Pack seven. Probably the same thing. Tension on him. Another wire. Another wire. Walleyes today. Eleven. Ten. Ten or eleven, I don't know. Fun. We're having fun. All right, everyone. Well, we had a heck of a day, man. Uh, we had to cut that video short because my phone was literally running out of space. So uh, I don't know if I'll get through this end of the video or not, but we had a great day. I stopped counting about 16 walleye. We were just slaughtering them all day, but they were, for the most part, they were all in that 13, 14 range. 12, 13, 10, some of them smaller ones. But any, anyway, it was, uh, it was fun. I mean, it almost got to the point where it was almost too much, because I was, I couldn't even get a line in before the next one would take off. So if it wasn't white bass, it was walleyes. And uh, they were, it was a good day. Everybody was catching walleyes. Like I said, they were all on the small side, but we did we did uh, catch like four keepers. So if I would have had some way of transporting them home, uh, we probably would have kept them. 